Hello traders, welcome to the weekly technical forex forecast for the 9th, 13th of April. My name is Andrew Szyneski, I am a technical analyst at Trim for Fix, and as usual, we start our forecast with EURUSD currency pair. The price tested the level of support 1.2227, but failed to break it down and then rose up on large volume. Now the euro is trading inside the local consolidation between two strong volume levels. The first one is the support and the second one is resistance 1.2342, 1.2357. As can be seen from the volume chart, large volume is concentrated within this consolidation. So the best decision with the euro is just to wait for a confident and drop exit of the price from this range. The breakout movement must be supported by the large volume in order to avoid any fake breakout and of course still be a more reliable signal for entering the market. Until then, while the price is located within this range, we should stay out of the market. The pound. The price also sold an abrupt growth and now is testing the level of resistance 1.4095. Given the fact that the rise of the pair was supported by the huge volume, we can consider a scenario of the breakout of this mark, which will be a great bullish signal and will allow us to open long positions with the pound. The breakout movement must be keen and supported by the large volume, which will be a more reliable signal for entering the market. A stop should be placed below the breakout volume bar, and the potential of the deal is around 110 120 pips. So, with the pound, long positions after the sure breakout of the level of resistance. The yen. After the test of the level of resistance 107.48, the price fell down sharply. Moreover, the drop was supported by the large volume, which is a great bearish signal. So, now, even despite the fact that there is a local uptrend, we can regard a scenario of opening short positions. Sales can be opened after a smooth upward correction of the price in order to get a better entry point. A stop loss should be placed a little bit above the level of resistance and the potential of the deal is around 100-110 pips. So with the yen, short positions after a smooth upward correction of the price. The Canadian dollar. The price tested the new formed level of support 1.2735 after that it showed an abrupt growth and now is testing in the middle of the local consolidation between the support and the level of resistance 1.2840 thus the best decision with the canadian dollar is just to wait for a confident exit of the price from this consolidation the breakout movement must be abrupt and supported by the large volume which should be more secure signal for entering the market. While the pair is located within this consolidation, we should skip this instrument from our trading plan. Our next instrument is the Australian dollar. The price is still trading in the local consolidation 0 0.7650, 0 0.7775. But given the fact that now the pair is located a little bit above the level of support, the lower limit of this range, we can consider a scenario of its breakdown, which will be a good bearish signal and will consent us to open short positions. The breakout movement must be sharp and supported by the large volume. A stop should be placed above the breakdown volume bar and a potential of the deal is more than 100 points. So with the Australian dollar, short positions after the confident breakdown of the level of support. If the price continues trading within this range, we should stay out of the market. And our last instrument for today is gold. The price tested the level of support 1323.10, 1324.40, and then demonstrated a huge growth on the large volume, which is a great bullish signal. So even despite the fact that gold is still located in the local consolidation, we can and should consider a scenario of opening long position. We can enter the market after a smooth downward correction of the price in order to get a better entry point. A stop should be placed below the test of the level of support 
and the target is the level of resistance, the upper limit of the local consolidation 1355.70. So with gold, long positions after a smooth downward correction of the price. Let's take a look at the sentiment of the market. This indicator confirms our deals with the pound, with the yen, with gold and with the Australian dollar, which is a good additional signal. With the euro and with the Canadian dollar, the situation is complicated as these currency pairs are located in ranges, so we need to wait for a confident exit of prices from consolidations and, on, and only after that we can regard new positions with these two currency pairs. For today it's all. Thank you guys for watching. Hope this forecast will be useful for you. Subscribe to our channel to stay in touch with the latest researches. See you. Bye bye.